we've kind of, as a society, lost touch with what growing and eating in season means. With the invention of the supermarket, you can go to the store and find everything and anything you want, but that doesn't necessarily mean that that's something that we as humans can maintain for the rest of forever. My name is Bobby Wislowski. I started here at City Roots in September of 2013 as an intern. We grow seasonal vegetables, fruit, and herbs on a year-round basis. We grow microgreens. We sell both here on site at a farmer's market, and then our products are also carried by Whole Foods, Earth Fair, and 14 Carat. In the beginning, they relied pretty heavily on volunteers and interns. Everyone who's currently employed, whether they're part-time or full-time, either started as an intern or a volunteer. Our greenhouse manager was a volunteer for a long time. She's actually a certified master gardener. And as the greenhouse became a bigger portion of the farm, uh, they brought on another intern. Marissa is our, another full-time staff member. She's our field manager. Uh, I, being the office and sales manager, we both started as, I did an internship and Marissa did some volunteer work. Everyone kind of has their favorite parts of things, and you know, work is work. It's not necessarily the easiest thing when you're out there in the field and under the hot sun and, or in the winter, but everyone has some sort of passion for local food, growing naturally and organically, and we all play a vital role in the overall success or failure of City Roots. I think it's great that we've got a diverse customer base because uh, that really allows us opportunities to offer everything to everyone. It's important, you know, that we get support locally, you know, that way we can also support those businesses that support us. Without our customers and our share, our, you know, whether it be, you know, somebody coming by our booth at market and purchasing, you know, our microgreens and cut flowers to the weekly order that we pack up to go to Charleston on Tuesday. Without them, we wouldn't be able to be in business. You know, you, we can grow as much as we want, but if we can't sell it to anybody, then what are we doing?